the math on how many BM, how much is up here. Okay. Uh, but I like to know <laughs> uh, how long it took you, which is very important. How long it took you to earn it? You can hear different stories, you guys. Nine hundred thousand dollars. How much? Nine hundred thousand dollars worth. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you, doctor. <laughs> uh, just tell us what kind of car you're driving. How long it took you to drive it? Um, get to it. Fifty-six days to get to it, and we're we're just letting them pay for the Impala till we pick out the BMW. All right. Get up. Get up there. All right. Get up there. It took us three months. Um, I have one and my husband qualified the next month after, so we are two BMW qualifiers in our house. And um, X5 diesel. Right. Ooh. Never had a brand new vehicle. It was uh, wrapped in plastic and they backed it off with a semi truck. So that's pretty cool. From a girl that came from nothing. Yeah! yeah. Tracy Pulley, we, it took me six months, but when I did it, my husband also qualified the same month I did. Um, and I have the only obnoxiously bright green BMW. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Lisa and Bobby Nicholson, it took us 70 days. Um, I drive a black 535i. Oh! And I'm shopping for my X5 right now for our second BMW. <laughs> yes! Great. Christy Keck, it took me six months to earn my BMW, and I drive a silver 528i. Yes! Naomi Barbour, it took me 27 days, and I drive a 535i. Oh! Yeah. Uh, Chris Wagner, 32 days, and it's a black 550i. Chris and Courtney Freeman, um, when we got started, it was a year. We really started running with those guys. It took us two months, qualified for our BMW, we went and got a BM, uh, 550i. Yes! What about the 5 Series, man? This is like... <laughs> wow, okay, that's good, man. 5 Series, no joke. That's a little bit more than 40, so let's add another 5 onto that. So, Doctor, if you get add another 5, <laughs> a little overage on this side, a little double heavy with the numbers on this side. <laughs> <laughs> took care of that. Mike show off. Listen to Matt and Jonna, build my house, got my BMW, my first party. Woo! Hi, everybody! <laughs> Hi, Jonna! Hi! Hi, BMW earners! Uh, we're Matt and Jonna Power. We're so happy to be here. We were challenged uh, 85 pounds ago between the two of us. So we absolutely love the challenge. Changed our life. That was also three and a half years ago. We challenged everyone we knew, loved, and cared about. We earned our BMW our first night. We've since helped hundreds do the same. Crossed our first million in earnings our first couple of years, and we're just getting warmed up, guys. St. Louis! Love you! Yeah. Jonna was driving a 7 Series when we uh, came to the company, and uh, we had just bought it. And it's the most uh, luxurious car we've ever owned. Uh, I've, and the funny part of when we got our BMW is we sat down with the dealer and he pulled out this stack of paperwork and I'm not, I'm not exaggerating, it was like this, and he set it in front of me and I said, what's all that? He says, a few forms you have to fill out for the finance. And I said, well, I didn't say anything about financing. And he said, well, everybody finances a 750 series because they're $90,000. And I said, well, do you guys do Chinese finance? And he goes, Chinese finance, what's that? I said, uh, one lump sum. We're just glad to be here. I was a uh, U.S. Army Ranger in the Green Beret prior to that. Uh -huh. People clap for that. I know. <laughs> um, and I got involved in network marketing after I broke my back skydiving in the military. I did it kind of as a, a way to make some extra money while I was rehabbing my body. It took me a couple of years, so I had to find a way to make a living while I could sit at home and be on a headset and on a phone because I couldn't drive and I had a hard time walking and I, I couldn't lift anything or carry anything. And uh, I made enough money in my first two years in network marketing to pay off all of my debts. I made over $300,000 in my first 24 months back in 1991 and 1992. And uh, since then, I met this lady, and uh, they say the best thing behind a powerful man is a pushy, obnoxious, mm -hmm. demanding woman. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but we've had a lot of fun. We've, helped, we've met a lot of new and interesting people. We've traveled around the world. Um, but this company has been the highlight of our career. 20 years 
of learning how to do this to be able to enjoy the last three years. To work with wonderful people like this. We've never Mr. been surrounded Tony. with people like Tony and Rhonda and the other leaders in this company. And let me just tell you about the three founders. Stellar men. Um, my, my heart, the first time I met them, I looked at them like they were young enough to be my son, because they are. And the second time I sat down with them, I sat down with them like, you guys are smart enough to be my mentor. Mm -hmm. And we came in very humble and said, you know, teach us how to do what you're doing. Um, I lost 51 pounds. I took 10 inches off my belt. Um, I'm 57 and a half years old. I'm in the best shape I've seen in 25 years, and we sincerely love what we're doing. <laughs> What I, what I love about uh, 